Well, it sounds like the Avengers 4 trailer is coming at us on Wednesday. So let's talk about what exactly this means and uh, what to expect and maybe what not to expect. Well, with Avengers 4, they gotta play really carefully here. Um, all the characters that died are dead from Infinity War, right? So you're gonna have to be very careful on how exactly you present this movie. Um, if you show Spider-Man, Black Panther, you know, and the other dead characters, then automatically we're going into this movie going, well, man, the stakes from that last movie were pointless, right? <laughs> so it kind of devalues Infinity War. So naturally, I think the smartest way to go into this is focus on only the characters that survive and not hint towards anything, you know, anything including anybody that got snapped away. And realistically, I think that's what they're gonna do. So you're probably looking at the core Avengers, which we know, you know, gonna consist of a Captain America, Iron Man, Thor, and then obviously the additions of like, including Captain Marvel, since she's gonna be pretty prominent throughout the MCU's future. And this is kind of um, where they have to, I think, uh, do more than what's expected. This is a trailer that's been so highly demanded that, you know, it's, um. It's been making headlines and trending on Twitter for months without actually having a trailer out. So the anticipation is so high that anything that could possibly be put out there is being like looked at with a you know like microscope for any detail. Just look at all the leaks that come out, right? And I think realistically, going into this trailer, you shouldn't expect all the story elements. Um, this is gonna be regarded as a teaser trailer, and that's really what you should be expecting, like Captain Marvel's first trailer. It's a bunch of cool shots, a bunch of visual things, but the story's not there yet. You know, we don't know what the overarching thing is gonna be. And I think in this, realistically, you're probably gonna get a few shots from the Infinity War trailer, kind of catching you up, maybe the snap, maybe people disintegrating, then the Avengers 4 logo, maybe pops up in some sort of weird, cool thing. And then you kind of gonna have, um you know, the build-up towards some sort of money shot at the end. Whether that's all the original Avengers standing together in whatever suits they're gonna be, or some big reveal of something that we're not expecting. Uh, most likely a new villain, I would say. Um, and I think the smartest choice to go is also to not show Thanos at all. Uh, we know he won. So why would he come back? He's completed his mission. Why would he attack Earth again, right? He, he doesn't know. So if they're organizing a plan, there's clearly been villains building up and doing whatever. So I think you kind of gotta maybe mention Thanos, but not directly show him. Or if you show him, that's the money shot of the trailer because we know he's gonna have new armor. We know he's gonna have the Infinity Sword from various leaks that have happened and various other things. So if you want your big money shot to be, oh look, Thanos isn't here. And then at the end we finally see him, he's like, oh, he thought I left just cause I won. Then make it the big money shot of everything. But other than that, they gotta be real careful with this trailer because the moment it comes out, it's never going to live up to what's in here and what you have in your head. And at the same time, it's going to surpass it. It's one of the only trailers I think that could possibly ever do this. Because as much as we know about this movie, we know nothing. Which is pretty incredible for a movie that's literally the most anticipated film since Star Wars Episode Nine, really? So, or... No, well, no, no, it's pretty anticipated. I would say since The Force Awakens, because that had Return of the Jedi and then all those, you know, years of waiting and the prequels weren't after Return of the Jedi. So there's a lot of buildup and a lot of anticipation and I hope they can get it right. 